Breaking at 8, starting with the dangerous heat wave, and Ginger is backtracking it all for us. Hi, nice hey, to see you, Hey, good morning Jen. to you. So breaking a daily record high temperature, you say, okay, that happens, but breaking them for three, four, five days in a row. That's why this heat wave has an extreme risk with it from the National Weather Service offices. Some of the records that were broken just yesterday, Toledo, Chicago, all in the mid to upper 90s. Cleveland had one, too, with the shot there of the lake, and Erie, Pennsylvania. So this is just day one or two, depending on where you are and we're going to keep going all the way through the start of the weekend. So heat advisories are in place, excessive heat warnings for Fort Wayne to Detroit, excessive heat watches for Philadelphia, most of New Jersey, up into New Hampshire and Maine, because we're going to see the biggest part of this Thursday into Friday in the northeast of New England. And watch that heat dome, because it doesn't really move. It doesn't budge much. See how Pittsburgh circled every day? Nashville will start to get into it as we get into the weekend. Could break some records there. Washington, D.C., too, in the 90s. And then we looked into next week and the following week and the following all the way into early July, and it looks like we stay quite warm, so we definitely have to get used to this. The overnight lows don't give relief, and that's where people mm. without AC have a problem. Okay. Seems like not long ago we have tornado records. Right. And now Hurricane, we're going to now this. All right, Ginger, thank you for bringing that to us.